What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P, and we have Black Friday, Cyber Monday, and the holiday is right around the corner, so I figured, why not give you guys a list of the best gaming keyboards of 2015, in case you want to pick one up for or after the holidays. Now I've personally tested and used a lot of these keyboards in the past, and when it came to considering which ones to include, I factored in a bunch of things like the price, the build quality, overall feedback, to make the best list possible for you guys. So all the links will be in the description down below if you're interested in checking them out, but without wasting any more time, let's start it off. Starting off with one of my first mechanical keyboards, and that's going to be the Perix PX5200. This keyboard is constantly on sale below $90, and especially for the holidays, you'll probably find it on sale for much cheaper. It features genuine cherry switches in blue. It has a white LED backlit feature. You can also get this in a red backlit feature, which is pretty cool if you wanna have that for your LED lighting scheme. There are eight programmable macro keys. It features N key rollover and a 12 key anti-ghosting in USB. Now what I really liked about this keyboard was for its overall size, it still was very compact and its build quality was very, very good. The white lights inside were very, very bright and they were actually like a true white lighting. So it fit in my setup really, really nicely. And it is one of my favorite keyboards that I've used that's not from a big brand. Next up is the ASIO MGK1 Backlit Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. And at first glance, this looks very, very similar to the Corsair Gaming K70 keyboard. The entire keyboard is an all black brushed aluminum finish. It features an optional detachable wrist rest, which is always a nice addition. It has a dedicated volume wheel on the top right hand side. And that's one of my favorite things on a keyboard, which is great for just adjusting the volume on the fly. You're getting full key rollover to ensure direct input accuracy. And they have these kale blue switches inside, which is what exactly Razer uses in their mechanical keyboards. Coming in at $70, this is a great keyboard. I love the way it feels. I'm in love with the way it looks. And I tested it in the past for the whole Amazon Vine campaign that I used to do. And um, it really, really blew me away. And again, with Black Friday, Cyber Monday, if you can add this even below $70, an absolute steal. Next up is a great cheap bundle. And that's the CM Storm Devastator with the keyboard and the mouse. The keyboard itself is fully backlit with a nice blue hue to it. We have dedicated media keys on top, and the entire keyboard is covered in a nice grip coating, which is gonna feel great on your hands. And the key switches are not kale, or they're not cherry, they're actually a membrane. So this isn't a mechanical keyboard, but it's gonna be great for someone who wants a little squishier feel when they're typing that won't disturb anybody, because these are pretty silent. But for the bundle, only $30. If you're on a budget, this is definitely for you. Now staying with CM Storm here, this is gonna be their CM Storm Quickfire TK keyboard. This one comes in at $70, but it gives you a lot more features than the Devastator does. This is a great looking compact mechanical gaming keyboard. You can get them in MX Cherry Red switches inside with a fully backlit keyboard overall. You can get them in blue switches with blue LEDs, brown switches with white LEDs, or green switches with green LEDs inside. But the most popular one is the red switches with red LEDs. They all vary at different prices, but like I said, the red switch option is much more commonly available. You're getting N key rollover on USB, a detachable braided USB cord, which is nice for cable routing. You get three LED light modes to put on a show for your friends and five levels of brightness if you want to adjust it. This is a pretty common keyboard. I see it a lot on room tour project submissions and for $70, I think it's a great deal, especially if you're looking to you know, try out a mechanical keyboard for the first time or you just want something new and compact. Winding down is the Logitech G710 Plus, probably one of the most popular mechanical keyboards on the market. Odds are you've seen it in the past because it is Amazon's top selling gaming keyboard. You can pick up this keyboard in Cherry MX Brown or Blue, and they're very nice tactile high speed keys. They have adjustable dual zone backlighting, which is great. They have six programmable macro keys, or as Logitech calls them, they're G keys. But there are three different macro preset buttons, so you can have up to 18 macros on your keyboard at all times. You get 110 anti-ghosting keys and a 26 key rollover to help you make all the right moves. For below $90, all the feedback shows it's a great keyboard, which is gonna prove why it is one of the best on the market. Next up is one of Razer's best-selling keyboards of all time, and that is the Razer Black Widow Expert Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. You can get it pretty cheap now for around $80, it's been around for a while, and it's just a nice standard gaming keyboard that's not gonna blow you away with any flashy LED lights or anything like that. So if you're more of a standard type of guy, this is gonna be great for you. 
we again have five programmable macro keys on the left side of the keyboard. On the right side, you have an included USB pass-through with a headphone and microphone jack, which is gonna be great. If you don't wanna have a ton of clutter and cables all over your desktop, plug it into your keyboard and you're good to go. They feature 10 key rollover for extreme anti-ghosting. And this is also gonna have your kale green switches that Razer uses, which is pretty much like kale blue. You can also use this with the Razer Synapse software, so you can assign any key, any function to be a macro, because the software is pretty great and it's very user friendly. And again, for only around $80, if you wanna go back to your roots with a nice simple mechanical keyboard for a pretty good price, this is a good option. Next up is a newer keyboard, and it is my go-to. It's probably one of my all-time favorites, and that's the Corsair Gaming Strafe RGB Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. It's relatively expensive at around $150, but again, if you can find it on sale for Black Friday, Cyber Monday, definitely pick it up. You can get it in MX Brown, you can get it in red, and on Best Buy, they have a silent option with a nice silent key switch inside, which is pretty new and pretty cool. The keyboard features 100% anti-ghosting with 104 key rollover. They include an FPS and MOBA keycap set with a keycap puller. You have a detachable wrist rest. And the genuine Cherry MX switches feel absolutely great. Very buttery smooth. And since it is an RGB keyboard, that means you can do some crazy lighting effects. The software makes it easy where they have a ton of presets for you. The lights are nice and flashy. They're individually backlit, so you can have a different lighting effect on each and every key. Each key is also programmable to be a different key or function. It is just one of my favorite keyboards of all time. And like I said, if you can find it for below 150, definitely pick it up. And I think even 150 is a great price. It's an awesome keyboard like this one. All right, that's gonna wrap up my video for the top gaming keyboards for the holidays coming up very, very soon. So if you're thinking of something to ask for Christmas, or you just want a better idea of something you can buy for the holidays with Black Friday, Cyber Monday, hope this list helped you out. If it did, please give the video a thumbs up to show your support. You can follow me on Twitter, at RandomFrankP. I'm always on there. And last, if you haven't already, feel free to hit subscribe. I've done a ton of tech videos in the past, gaming setup videos. So if you like this kind of stuff, you're not going to want to miss out on some future videos. Alright guys, I'm RandomFrankP. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day.